One of the things I remember about coming to Capital E as a child is the way it made me feel. It was such a fun, um, magical, sort of sensory place that I'll never forget. I've been lucky enough to have played here at Capital E a few times, uh, once with Orchestra Spheres, also with Lord Echo, that was an amazing gig. The kids just took over the whole stage, took over our instruments, and there was no such thing as the audience and the band, it all became intermingled, and it was, it was a total hoot. I think the most special thing about Capital E as a child is getting to do professional experiences and not feeling patronised at all. Getting to present in what felt like a real newsroom with real technology, the, you know, the camera, the teleprompter, the whole news crew. I think that was a big influence on being able to know that, you know, I've got this, I can be professional, I can be independent or whatever it is later in life. My first memories of Capital E were coming in with my mum and my little brother. Um, we went to Capital E when it was over at Civic Square and we saw the Lego exhibition and that was so cool. It was just like something I'd never ever seen before. I like to express my creativity with my children. We do all kinds of stuff, dancing, singing around the living room, drawing, making Lego like me and my brother used to do. My first memories of Capital E was when I was in primary school and we made a short film there. What was cool is all of my classmates were either behind the computer editing, behind the camera filming, or in front of the camera acting as the broadcasters. It made me quite passionate about, about the art of filmmaking. Since playing at Capital E, I've done a bit of acting over the years in theatre, um, which set me on an interesting path, working in music management with a lot of kind of well-known um, yeah, New Zealand musicians and icons. I've worked at music festivals. Capital E was great for um, just that free f open learning or free learning, I guess. Um, the creativity was there. There were things for kids in general, all of us to kind of run around and be crazy, but also be pulling on tactically grabbing things and gluing things, sticking together, climbing up into areas that um, adults weren't allowed in. They physically couldn't get in there. Quite often, you know, we sort of grow up and learn how to do things correctly or formalise things through training and quite often we lose that imagination and childlike approach to creativity and um, from my experience of even just coming here with my own children and from performing here, there's always that engagement of tapping into your inner child as an adult and um, I think that's really important. Capital E is a unique um, place. There's no other place like it in Wellington um, and it's so important to um, for children to have a place where they can be, they can play, they can feel free to express their um, creativity um, and Capital E is a fantastic resource and it enables children to do that 